More than 200 at risk animals are flying to a second chance at finding a loving home. Danielle Garcia was there as they loaded them up to take off and has their story. <laughs> Roughly 230 pets are flying to their rescue. The largest transport Acadiana Animal Aid or Wings of Rescue has ever done. Having an opportunity to attend these pets out of state really helps us free up space in our shelter so that we can pull animals and pets from municipal shelters where they might be at risk of euthanasia. Volunteers spent the morning loading the crates onto the plane. All right. Thank you. Go up. So that these sweet dogs and cats can go from unwanted to completely loved. The interesting thing is that the average length of stay for kittens and puppies in Seattle, Washington is zero to three days. Adult dogs and cats, five to eight days. Here in Louisiana, where we are, our pets can stay in our shelter anywhere from 30 days to two months, sometimes longer. And I admit, I almost went home with my own little friend. I'll take her home with me instead of going on the plane. While most shelters in Louisiana are overcrowded, Washington has the opposite problem. Executive Director of Acadiana Animal Aid, Janine Fouché, says Louisiana's overpopulation issue is partly because there's not many options for low-cost spaying and neutering. Spaying and neutering your pet if you're impoverished can actually be a very pricey situation. So in Washington state there are tons of clinics that offer it at a very reasonable price. So people take advantage of that and they've mitigated the pet overpopulation problem. Wings of Rescue has saved nearly 3,000 animals this year after today's transport and project that number to grow to roughly 13,000 by the end of the year. And literally there's going to be lines of people when we land who are going to be like, it's going to be like Beatlemania when they see these puppies. After two hours, the plane is filled and ready to take its passengers to their new forever homes. In Lafayette, Danielle Garcia, KTC TV3.